Hello friends, thanks for clicking. I Dr. Dinesh welcomes you all. Today we will discuss about the most important and most common issue for all the researchers that face such kind of the issue that your research paper or their research paper will get rejected from the Scopus Index Journal or the SCI Index Journal or reputed international journal or UGC care journal. So why it happens? So there are the so many reasons behind this scenario with and this issue so today we will discuss about these kind of the issue and why their research paper will get rejected or will uh, get uh, accepted so what are the reason behind this scenario and uh, there are the so many tips or uh, most important tips to all of you how to write a good research paper so you will get acceptance for publication your manuscript from the scopus index journal sc index journal or reputed international indexing journal so let's see start the topic so in the series of this particular journal so first uh, these are the cycle of the particular journal so when a researcher or faculty member or student submit their research paper to the journal any journal so these are the most common cycle or uh, processing of this particular acceptance rejection kind of the cycle of this particular paper publication so normally we already uh, all the researchers get submit your research paper and their research paper to the journal and general what will do journal so here the general editor after acceptance after uh, submission your research paper general editor start their work and they so firstly check the pelagrism report so if your pelagrism report comes under this uh, mac criteria the general criteria as per the general criteria may be possible 10 percent pelagrism report should be there 15 percent or 20 percent 30 percent like that so it's up to it's maybe very general to journal so it's not the fix so first of all plagiarism report should be matched with the general criteria second one thing title should be matched with the journal uh, journal aim and scopes topic should be matched so and also the paper formatting you have followed or not so these are the basic thing that you should uh, being a researcher before submission your research but the uh, these following things you should ensure keep uh, in mind before submission your research paper if you uh, did not follow these guidelines so finally you will get the rejection or major, major changes so major change is nothing but that is a kind of improvement in your research paper that you have already submitted so these are the kind of first cycle so you will get the rejection within a uh, two or three days or within a week most probably so it's for the dependence it's per it's up to dependency on the general so if your research paper or manuscript uh, find suitable as per the general title topic paper formatting is good there is no issue and also the paper uh, pelagrism report also the match with the general category so this is the start the uh, third third cycle or second cycle kind of the reviews means kind of the acceptance but uh, you will not get the receive the acceptance like this so here the general editor will forward their your research paper or their research paper to the reviewers so their uh, technical reviewers those uh, who have appointed already so sent to the reviewers so most probably it's a uh, same paper uh, sent to the two or three reviewers or most probably more than two or three reviewers so kind that's why we are saying always always blind review or peer reviewed journal so that is the actually meaning one paper is reviewed by the many journal many reviewers or technical expert or subject experts topic experts so after acceptance the or rejection of the all the kind of the information or kind of the inputs received from the reviewers uh, general editor decide what, what is the major uh, uh, drawback or major quality of the submitted papers on the behalf of this type of the issues or inputs from the reviewers blind review or peer reviewed and then uh, general editor finally decide the uh, about your research paper acceptance or rejection so finally you will get the acceptance rejection or maybe possible you will get the some minor changes so finally if you improve your research paper as per the general editor guideline definitely it will again check all the criteria as per the general guideline or editorial board members uh, 
tricks or reviewers uh, view or kind of the reviews inputs so on the behalf of this uh, kind of the process finally you will get the acceptance or rejection of minor changes so that's why this process take the long time because this is the very crucial or very important or significant role played by all the reviewers and journal editor if journal is the good quality so i am talking about the scopus index journal or sci index journal or or uh, dblp journal ugc care list journal so that's why it's the, it is that uh, longer process that's why you take uh, sometimes you feel the there is the longer process from the lcbr springer and the reported bele publication uh, taylor and francis sage publication there are the so n number of uh, good uh, journals are available so that's why this need uh, it take the longer process for uh, acceptance rejection or kind of minor change so this is the first way that you will get the acceptance rejection about your research paper now after this what uh, uh, what are the reasons and guidelines to make paper error free suppose you will get the rejection or you can will get the minor change in your research paper or manuscript so what you should do so the, so today we will discuss about the important factor that you should keep in mind so what are the things you should uh, include in your research paper so definitely you will get the acceptance and quickly acceptance from the journal reputed journal like the scopus and sci index journal so first i guideline is the journal selection so before so, publishing or before submission your research paper you have to the researcher should follow the first guideline that choose the journal appropriately so if your journal having the different title and journal is the different and your research title is different then you will get the rejection from the journal so nothing matter that your paper is the good quality or not because they doesn't match the with the journal criteria or journal topic so always choose the appropriate journal as per your research topic or aim and scope at defined by the journal so before journal selection or at the time of the journal selection you should very carefully choose the journal or an after selection of the journal you should see the indexing or abstracting of the journal whether it is indexing in scopus or sci index journal or ugc care journal as per your requirement you can check because at the end you will get the publication in this particular journal so Uh, next criteria you should know about the publication time and fees so after uh, submission there is nothing possible to you have to check out all the these three things so always keep in mind these three things before selection of the journal and uh, about the indexing of the journal and about the publication time or fees so whether it is paid or unpaid journal so it's a it's it is the first step of journal selection of your research paper publication after this follow the journal guideline if you have selected the right journal appropriate journal as per your research topic research aim and scope then you need to follow the journal guideline so as per it may vary it, it is up to the journal to journal so it may vary journal to journal may be possible scopus guideline is different sage publication guideline different as the index journal is also the different so is it may vary to the journal to journal so read all the author guideline carefully uh, and each and every journal will provide the submission guideline and author guideline in properly so always read out all the guideline properly and accordingly accordingly prepare your manuscript or research paper or article so this is the second way after selection of the journal then you need to follow the journal guidelines uh, to write your manuscript or prepare your manuscript for the publication so after the uh, publication and after the second criteria third criteria is the pellegrin pellegrin nothing but that is a kind of uh, theft or kind of your manuscript should be original means you should not take the Uh, article something like the diagram methods and from the other paper kind just kind and copy and paste material from the uh, someone uh, author so check your manuscript pellegrin before submission to publish so first of all you need to uh, careful about the general acceptance rate and general criteria what uh, type of percentage general accept about like the 10% pellegrin report 
is accepted or 15% 20% so it also may vary the general to generous may be possible it's up to the scopus is the scopus may be different uh, uh, field to field topic to topic so it may vary so uh, read out it carefully each and every journal so whether it is a 10 percent acceptance ratio and 50 percent acceptance ratio so before submission you should uh, check about the pilgrim so there are the so many pilgrim report checker also available on the uh, over the internet so you can just download and uh, just scan all the things and uh, if you Pelagrism report of your manuscript comes under this particular 10% and 15%. So uh, most of the journal prefer the 10% or 15% uh, acceptance ratio about the pelagrim so that is a kind of considerable part of the pelagrim report of your research paper so your research paper should be authentic and should be original your own research paper next uh, the common mistake is the grammatical mistake so um, there are the so many researchers do uh, such kind of the mistake there are the so many grammatical errors in the uh, in their research paper manuscript or article so uh, it's my suggestion to all of you before submission your research paper or at the time of the preparation of your uh, research paper you have to finalize you have to fix it about the grammatical okay so what there are the so many online available tools are available for the grammatical mistake like the grammarly and spell checker there are the so many free tools are available for the researcher so you can just check it uh, from this kind of the tools and uh, one more thing you can do if your friends or colleagues say uh, or back or back comes from the english background or you you can just pay for the money pay money uh, like the uh, for the as a proof reader so they will uh, fix it as uh, these kind of the grammatical mistake from your research paper or manuscript so it will be better before submission your manuscript or research paper it should be free from the grammatical mistake so these are the most common things or most common common observable things from the journal editors or review there are the so many grammatical mistakes in the research paper next one is the research is outdated so it's my suggestion it's my recommendation to all of you researcher always pick the current topic or problem to and innovative problem for your research so most of the journals are looking for these topics and weight is such kind of the topics on priority way means if your research pay topics is outdated so there is also the common factor or for the rejection of your research paper so it's my suggestion always select the current topic and the hot topic of a particular problem then uh, that it should reflect a kind of innovation so this type of the innovation topics always uh, so many journals looking for kind of the innovation innovative topics so, and they provide the kind of uh, opportunity or baitage and it take the uh, it on the priority basis so these are the common factor for the rejection and also the acceptance ratio on the if your topic is the very innovative and uh, very current topic that uh, always gen all general will uh, seeking like this type of the topic so your general should be out should not be the outdated next one is the lack of supporting evidence suppose if you are claiming that your work is original original but at the time of the general side general editor side or review side if your uh, material if your manuscript find out there are the so many errors there are the so many copy and paste material then it also the kind of comes under the category of the rejection so uh, it's my suggestion your research paper should be the your original work and do and uh, only 10 percent 50 percent are most of the journal are acceptable considerable part of the pilgrim report so pilgrim report should be match near about the journal criteria if your uh, uh, Pilgrim report match with the general criteria then these are the kind of the chances and probability of the acceptance of your research paper so always try to make your own research paper original work so it will get the benefit to uh, about your acceptance of their research paper next one is the poor analysis of topic and results so if you have not done the good analysis on that particular topic for which you have prepared a a manuscript or research paper and you are going to publish your research paper so that is a kind of one reason for the rejection because you have not done the good analysis good uh, you have not choose the current topic you have not choose the very good 
topic or problem like this so always the good journals uh, always seek the good innovative topics and the results should not be incomplete it may be a kind of rejection part and selection of the method selection of the technology selection of the different types of the working procedure that have already been not by the publisher by the many researchers so it should be the kind of original work or kind of the innovative work so always keep in mind and your analysis should be and your analysis and your also survey should be good and good analysis on that particular problem on which you are going to publish your research paper next category is the topic is the paper is under review at another journal me most of the researcher they do they submit their research paper for another uh, journal and at, at the same time they also submit for the publication at the scopus index journal and sci index journal so this is not the good thing okay, a same paper will get published by the two journal at that end uh, uh, you have to fill the copyright form so it is a kind of uh, there is no i suggest to all of you should not uh, do follow this like this uh, kind of the process so like under process review that you have to wait for the publication from that journal and the, after all the summary so what you should take in care of that particular before me preparing or manuscript or your publication of research paper so general selection should be the good your as per the your research topic aim and scope next one is the follow the journal guidelines properly so accordingly you have to prepare your manuscript and uh, article for the publication and plagiarism report should not be more than the 10 to 15 percent and uh, you should see about the general criteria for the acceptance of the plagiarism report check the grammatical mistakes so there are the so many tools are available grammarly and spell checker there are the so many tools are available free of course that you have to check your research paper research paper manuscript or article before publishing next one is the research should be the current topic and should not be the outdated lack of supporting evidence so your your uh, evidence your uh, what are the you are claiming about your research paper manuscript should be matched with this particular at the end of the general criteria and the your analysis should be the good so poor analysis is the one of the reason for your reje rejection your research paper and paper is under review at another journal so that is a kind of one reason for your research paper rejection and your manuscript or paper does not fall within the journal's aim and scope so these are the following criteria if you uh, follow these guidelines and if you try to avoid these kind of the things so definitely you will get the acceptance from the scopus index journal and sa index journal or ugc care journal list for your accept and quickly within a 20 days within a month you will get the response from the journal's editor regarding the your acceptance or minor change may be possible so if you follow these kind of the things in proper way or properly manner so definitely you will get the acceptance most probably you will get the acceptance from the journal editor so these are the kind of summary of your research paper or manuscript preparation so friends thank you for watching this video and if you like this video if you find useful this video then definitely subscribe this channel and definitely you will get the new video every morning 8 am thank you friends for watching this video